If you're happy and you know it's Zydeco. If you're happy and you know it's Monge. If you're happy and you know it, nothing ever will help you show it. If you're happy and you know it, it's the ball. Welcome to the Swamp Road TV show coming to you from Black Gold Casino and do a song even louder than before. How's it go? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And the people is excited. They are excited. Before we get real excited, we do want to acknowledge one of our dear friends who would come to the show anytime we could get a ride because he was legally blind. He couldn't see the drive, so he didn't have a car. Sometimes he even walked from downtown, do something. To come meet us right here. That's right. But our dear friend, Nelson. Nelson Crater. That's right. He passed away earlier today right there. He'd be sitting at that chair where Bird's at right now. That's right. So for the family, condolences right there. But he was a great guy all the way around. Lil Buck, what's been going on in your world? Not too many. Not too many? Not too many. Where the, to the fall and the festival season is kicked up. Full force. <laughs> We, guess, we, we have a sponsor that knows all about that, too. We do. Uh, Let's drop that in right now. I'm going to do that sponsor right now. Yeah. LaFayettetravel.com. Uh -huh. It is festival season. You planning that trip to the Lafayette area? Because I will say this. If you're watching this show on a Thursday, that weekend is going to be Festival of Cotillon de Creole. Right. Yeah. LaFayettetravel.com. Find out everything that's going on in the Lafayette area. They're going to tell you where to stay, what to do, where to eat, what, what not. I think they even tell you what not to what do not when to you're eat. in they Lafayette. So LaFayetteTravel.com, they make this show possible because, hey, it, it is Lafayette, and uh, it's going on over here. Now, friends, over here at Black Oak Casino, 24 hours, seven days a week, giving that money out, giving that money out. You want to try a little adult entertainment. You know, I figured this out. I didn't go to college, but a few things I figured out is that uh, anything you do for fun pretty much costs. That's right. You go fishing, you go hunting, you go play golf, anything gonna cost you something. But you come out here to the Black Gold Casino, put your money in the machine and everything, you might come out behind, but you can have some fun. Or you oftentimes you come out ahead uh -huh. over here at Black Gold Casino. And where they put that money at? Dans le poche. Ça met l'argent dans le poche ici. Et dans l'argent dans le poche ici. Et des fois, Dot Lajon EC, right there. They do it all. If people win some money, but they even call their family, bring a bucket. I'm, I'm winning a whole lot of money here. That's the Black Gold Casino and Duso. 24 and then, uh, hours a day. 24 hours a day. But they got happy hours over here. How many hours? That was multiple hours. Okay. Four to seven. Four to seven. So, like, all the drinks is cheap like that. Very cheap. And even if it's not happy hour, it's, the drinks it's are still, still cheaper cheap. than most places right there. That's right. And then. Next door, we have a great place to eat a nice lunch or dinner. Rascal's Cajun Restaurant. The menu, order of the menu is fantastic, but they do have some special things going on during the week. So, like mm -hmm. on Wednesday night. Yeah, we, that's tonight. We're here tonight. on Wednesday night, every it, other Wednesday. But it don't matter if we're here on a Wednesday night. It's still a special? It's still a special. And what's that special is? Steak night. Uh, what they got, like a, a good piece of round steak or something? Uh, rib uh, rib eye. Uh, rib eye, okay. They got the fixings with All it? All the trimmings. Uh, if it's a special, it must come in like at about $29. Uh, less than $15. Less than $15. $14.99. Uh, you can't beat that right here. That's every Wednesday evening right here. And then on Thursdays, they got a lunch, a lunch special. Big buffet. Of fried chicken. Fried chicken. What part do you like the most? Eat just that if you want to. And all the sides as well. And you can also order off the menu anytime as well. And then every Friday is Good Friday at Rascal's Cajun Restaurant here. Seafood buffet. Yeah, there's going to be some fried shrimp. Fried, fried shrimp. Fried catfish, seafood gumbo. Seafood, whatever, whatever they got that's in season and can be on a buffet, they're mm -hmm. going to put it for lunch. I bet they got some of that seafood jambalaya. I think Joe oh. Hall liked that a whole lot too. I and, like and then it. all the trimmings. I mean, you, <laughs> all can, the trimmings? you can't have a meal without a side. So they got all the sides as much as you can eat too. All of that there. And then, of course, Right when you get off the highway onto the property, ShopRite Tobacco Plus. Got a great price on quality Exxon fuel and a whole lot of other stuff. The name says it all, ShopRite and Tobacco Plus. Uh -huh. So if you're in all the tobacco and the pluses, they got them all. Yeah. And they got ice, it's cold, and it's cheap. Yeah, it's the cheapest ice around. They got and, an ice. It's colder it, than everybody else's. They got an icy machine that's never broken. It's always working, that's right. And they got some little knickknacks. They got driving food mm -hmm. if you want to bag up. 
pork cracklings yeah. or chicken cracklings. Uh, some boudin balls, boudin egg rolls, rolls and stuff. Stuffed bread and then alcohol, all levels. All, like, all levels? Hard, medium, and soft at a great price. Uh, they got it all right here. So pretty much everything you need. North side of I-10, do so exit. Look for the big American flag with the uh, area that's uh, devoted to our veterans. So, Lil Buck, I think this guy's been on the band a few times. I recognize a couple of others, especially the one holding the bottom back there on the base end. Uh -huh. Didn't hear a bunch. He's the best one in the business. It's going to be a great show. Listen to it. Dance here if you're here, like a lot of people are, or if you're at the house. And if you're in the nursing home, you're gonna, you won't need that chair anymore. You won't need that rolling chair anymore. Once this band starts playing, you're going to forget that you'll walk back to your room after that, make your new boyfriend, maybe. Who we got with us here tonight on the Swamp Roll Show at Black Gold Casino in Duso? Joe Hall and the Cane Cutters. Cut it! <laughs>
Joe Hall and the cane cutters is just starting to cut a little cane. We're just at the beginning of the roll right now. We got a whole lot more cane to cut. And before the commercial break, Joe, you got another one in there? Yes, sir. Let's do it. to the Swamp Road TV show we film live here at Black Oak Casino in Doosan. If you're watching us online, I say this all the time. We mentioned them earlier. LafayetteTravel.com. Go check them out. Also, Cindy's Almost Famous Rue. We are, we are finally to the season of the year where we can use a roux to make what we need to make. Well, unless you like to cook a gumbo when it's hot, but Cindy's Almost Famous Rue is going to make that gumbo, that stew, a lot easier for you to make. Cindy's Almost Famous Rue. Look for it in your local grocer's frozen item. Check them out online. They're going to tell you where they're available at. Cindy's Almost Famous Rue. They help make the Swamp and Road TV show possible. Like tonight, we got Joe Hall and the Cane Cutters. I done found him. He's right here in front of the stage. Right, Mr. Joe, give me a handshake, baby. I've been knowing you for a few years, it seems. Pardon You've me? been on the show a few times, too, I think, yeah, yeah, in right. different locations through the years, possibly, That's even. Right. Right? That's right. Great to have you here. Talking to your mic right there. Tell us, what were some influences that made you decide, I want to start playing the music creole as I Kokomsa? First, first, first influence was my grandfather. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got a really cool name. What was his name? King Ned. King Ned. King and, Ned. And where was he from? He was from Mamu. Yeah, okay, yeah. I knew he was kind of local Mamu units uh -huh. right there. That's yeah, awesome. King Mamu. Ned. How can you not follow that? That's right. And then there was Boisek Ardoin. Uh huh. Noten Simeon. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, and I, I love some Mark Savoy. Well, of course. Well, you yeah. got some good influences right yeah. there, and reflects in the music that you play. And I'm thinking you just do this kind of for fun and let's make a little extra money, but you have a, a regular job, though. Yes, sir. 
That's why you can enjoy performing because it's not your livelihood is not dependent on it that much. That's right. That's yeah, right. so that's good. That's well, right. keep doing what you're doing. I love what you're doing. The band, we don't have a whole, whole lot of people here, but those that are here are enjoying it because you give them some easy to dance to songs. And then that's when you right. get old like me, you don't want to get caught in a six minute song and have to get <laughs> off of the floor right here. Now, two and a half, three minutes, old school. I love it. We're going to do three more in a row right here from Joe Hall and the King Cutters coming to you from Black Gold Casino, KDCG TV. Delta Media.
back to the Swamp Road TV show. We film live here at Black Oak Casino in Doosan. We got to thank a few people that make this possible. 
One, KDCG, Delta Media, they've they, they been carrying it forever. The other is Black Gold Casino and ShopRite Tobacco Plus. Without them, we wouldn't have a place to film. The other is LafayetteTravel.com. Get on the internet, go to LafayetteTravel.com, find out everything that's going on in the Lafayette area. It's festival season, we deep into it. LafayetteTravel.com. Festival Cardiens coming up, every other festival in Lafayette. I wish I knew them all, but we'd have to do a whole show on the festivals, but LafayetteTravel.com will tell you what to do, where to go, and how to get there. And then Cindy's almost famous root. It's time to cook that gumbo. It's time to cook that stew. You might even use a little root to cook your spaghetti. I don't know, because everybody cooks different. Cindy's almost famous root. They're going to help make it easy. Look for it in your local grocery in the freezer section. Cindy's almost famous root. Tonight, we got Joe Hall and the cane cutters. Thank you, little buck. Now, Joe, we spoke on the phone uh, recently, and you said you're working on a new CD. You sent me a song, which I like that little jig that you sent me right there. Exactly. So uh, the CD, is it getting close? Like it'll be out like maybe in about two or three months or so, or what? Try next week. Next week. Next week. A whole new CD done next week. <laughs> next week. So if you want to buy a physical CD, they could go see you live in performance. Yes, but sir. then it's going to be on all the uh, electronic delivery sites as well exactly. right there. Exactly. And it's going to be kind of what we hear tonight, I'm pretty sure. You're not making a drastic change and going oh, to no. heavy metal or anything no. like that. Not yet. Not no. yet. No, no, not yet. <laughs> not ever. <laughs> not yet. <laughs> Great guy. Easy to dance to. I love his music. The, the whole band. The music is real rootsy. It's that Creole, you know, that combination of Zydeco, what we call Zydeco, and Cajun and all that stuff. It sounds great, Joe. Lil Buck, you got a couple of guys. What in the back over there? He's making me nervous. He looks real familiar. Well, wherever you want to go first, wherever you go first. I got this guy here in the back, and he's been knowing me way longer than I've been knowing him. And we're just going to let him know. Stop, stop telling people that. We're just going to let him know. That. He's going to let him know your name and where you're from. My name is Chuck Bush. I'm from Rosa, Louisiana. That's right, Chuck Bush. Who? Like, like Chuck and Chuck and Chuck and Bush? There, and Chuck and there's so many bands he's played with, and there's so many times. He's probably been on a TV show more than I have because my not, dad did it for a long not time. Quite, yeah. Not quite, not quite. <laughs> Chucky, I, I've been knowing Chucky since I'm probably eight years old. Yeah. And uh, it's amazing every time I see you play bass. I, I've, I've seen you at so many venues, and I've seen so many people Guest musicians want to go play with you. So that has to say a lot. Uh, and you cannot lie, there's so many drummers who want to go play drums to play with Chucky. Thank you for what you do. Thank you for keeping Appreciate the music it. going. It. It, it's amazing what you do. Just let me know I'm doing something right. Oh, you're doing it right, man. Thank right, you, Chucky. Man. Thank you, Chuck Bush. And the man playing fiddle right here, your name and where you're from? Uh, Forrest Yvonne from Cecilia, Louisiana. From so, Cecilia? Yeah. Go Bulldogs? Go Bulldogs. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Right. Now, you're playing fiddle, but there's some there's some other instruments you play. I might have went to a brewery one time in Arnaville, and you were playing a different instrument. Yeah, I play accordion, but, you know, I have Joe to think about that because I learned accordion from Joe. So, what? wait, 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 what, what, what? Yeah. So, so Joe Hall taught you how to play accordion? Joe Hall was the, one of the biggest accordion players that I learned from. We went to Nunu's in Arnaville, Louisiana, and uh -huh. taught, he taught me. He put me in a corner and made me practice. I, 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 it's not me. He's a hue ball. <laughs> so it's a little easier when you're a hue ball. The first time I saw Joe Hall was at the Swamp Row TV show in Alphalusis. My dad was uh, doing it, and you had just released a CD live at Nunu's, uh -huh. and I fell in love with, with your music and your style. And you, you, you don't play a lot of shows around here, but you get around. You go all over the world playing this music. So thank you for spreading this all over the world. Oh, thank y'all. Thank you. Oh, no, thank you. I got a guitar player right here. He looks familiar. I kind of met him again a while back, but I, I think he has probably has a, a, a what you call a big resume like a lot of them. Yes, sir, young man, tell us your name and where you hail. Uh, Ronnie Dunes, Lafayette, Louisiana. Ronnie Dunes from Lafayette, Louisiana. I'm going to go ahead and stretch that this is not the first band you ever played with, Mr. Ronnie. Who's some bands you've played with through the years? Uh, through the years, right now I'm working with Gerard Delafoss. I've worked with Gino, uh, uh, all right. Leroy, all right, and, all right. and all those guys. Yeah. You're pushing all the good buttons right there. I, I love it, man. Uh, and I appreciate you hitting that guitar and you, that smile you got and everything. I know you enjoy helping these young guys out. Oh, yeah. Now, this guy right here, I kind of thought I knew who it was. And, and then when I heard cuckoo, 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 I know exactly who it was. Let's get it. I know he's a stand-up kind of guy right there. Go ahead and stand up so you can get a good shot of it. Tell us your name and where you're from like that. Uh, Paul Levan. I'm originally from Elton. 
but staying in Brazil for 13 years now. Uh, the nephew of uh, Leroy Thomas, grandson of Leroy Thomas, first cousin with Keith Frank, Gino Dulafos. Yeah. Well, you got a, you got good credentials right there. That cuckoo 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 cuckoo. When you that little role, where does that come from? Well, from the man himself, Leo Thomas, the bull, the one and only. Yes, indeed, all in the blood. I think Dude, a great credential man. is he stays in Bazil now. I no, mean, he stays in Bazil right there. That's a great there. credential right there. So, uh, Leo was your grandfather or what? Yes, sir, that's my mom's dad. Uh, that's be uh, beautiful right there because uh, that's a patented Leo Thomas role right there. Anytime I hear that, it's, if somebody shouts out Leo, you know, it's going to happen just like that right there. But I've, sounds great, man. I've seen him stand up like he is right now and do the Leo role. <laughs> <laughs> like, my heart. <laughs> there we go. Let's try this just for the fun of it. My own recorder. Try it out. Why you want to make me cry, baby? <laughs> there you go. This is the Swamp and Roll TV show coming to you from Black Gold Casino and Do Something. Joe Hall and the Cane Cutters. Whenever you see him on the marquee, if you see him playing here and there, and if you're watching this online from anywhere else, there's a good chance he's going to show up at your town at some point. All right, let's do a few more right here on the Swamp Roll TV show. Joe Hall and the Cane Cutters.
Schaffebrüne. Back to the Swamp and Roll TV show with film live here at Black Gold Casino and Doosan. Watch us online at kdcg.com. Also, just maybe Google us. YouTube might pull up. I think they got some YouTube videos of us. Um, it's great. Watch us on uh, everywhere. Everywhere you can watch us, watch us. Come live, watch us. Look us up on Facebook, Swamp and Roll on Facebook. We're going to let you know a few days before, let you know who the band is. It don't cost nothing to be on Facebook. So, like, on Monday, we put it on here. It was Joe Hall and the Cane Cutters, and you could be here right now. Look us on Facebook, Swamp and Roll TV show. You could even even do like our friend Shane. You could get in the restaurant right there, order you a little something to go and come eat it inside right here while you listen to the band. That's right. Do it. They have the whole package. And if you're running low on fuel, you could go ahead and get you some fuel right here, ShopRite Tobacco Plus, north side of I-10, do some all the same roof. And then if you want to get an icy for the way home, you could do that too. Or, or bag of ice for the hard alcohol you bought. I like that. Icy, icy and corn chips. I like that. It's icy, that's good. your go-to, huh? Yeah, and Dr. Pepper and corn. Anything with corn chips or Anything something like that. Anything with corn chips. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. good. I think Paul likes that as well. That's right. Joe Hall, the band sounded great. What's some places y'all play at on a semi-regular basis in a Kadiana area? been doing uh, next week will be a festival of Cadian Creole. Uh, so we're filming this the week before that, but when you watch it, you get ready because when it shows and, the and, first and time. You're going to watch it on Thursday. That, that, yeah. that, that's the, the 15th, the Saturday, uh -huh. we'll be at the Feed and Sea. All right. And the Sunday, we'll be at uh, Festival of Cadian. But if somebody wants to book this band, La Musique Creole is article in Francais aussi. That's pretty easy. What's the best way to find you? JoeHallMusic.com. Oh, it doesn't get, everybody knows how to spell Joe. If you don't, I can't help you. And then Hall pretty much is pretty easy to spell too, right there. So uh, go JoeHall.com and you can find them. You can book them for your festival or whatever the case may be right there. So Joe, you got one ready to go? We'll do one at least and we'll see where we go from there. Joe Hall and the Cane Cutters, they'll go do it for you too. You're watching KDCG TV. This is a Swamp and Roll show, Delta Media. Tata rub, tata rub, tata rub, the bone 
Joe Hall, that's another one of those uh, Chanson de Creole, Robin baby. Patterson. That was... Uh, the Carriers, baby. Oh, yeah, there you go, baby. <laughs> Sounds great. I love this. Keeping the roots going and easy to dance on. And I like that the songs are not real long because I'm getting old. So if my wife was here, I would dance with her. But we'd have to go see you at some point right there. Yes, Thank sir. you, Joe Hall. And, the, and all them cane cutters right there. And Appreciate a, you. And a brand new CD recording coming out very soon. Go to all your digital downloads. Buy it on there, but if you see him live, buy two copies of it live. That's right. While you're there, buy him a hard copy. Right, buy that right there. It'll help him out even better. So, Lil Buck, it's been a great show. I thank the people that came in and did some dancing for us and everything. And uh, we do the show every other Wednesday. And the best way to not miss anything is how? Get on Facebook and like us. We, we're not on any other social media platform. Get on Facebook and like us. We might be on social media other platforms later, but I'm um, not slow enough yeah. yet in my life to do that. So. Yeah. So uh, Swamp and Roll show, just like that. Just Swamp and Roll? Swamp and Roll. All right, I like it a whole lot. So I think we did everything we need to do. I think so. We had some great music right here, great band, great audience right here. We thank them a whole lot. I think a lot of them are kind of tired like we were. I forgot what that was this weekend, but something kind of wore us down. I'll say it. We was in rain at K-Bone Fest for well, Down Syndrome the, yeah. Association of Acadiana. That's so. right. It was a great fundraiser for Down Syndrome Association of Acadiana. We thank all those that went over there. And that's a lot of y'all nodding their heads. We appreciate that. So. In the words of his dear departed dad, <clears throat> so when Joe was on the first time he was on the Swamp Road TV show that was at uh, the former location at uh, Caso Lane, Caso a long time ago. So in memory of that, and for Dr. Feelgood, classic term, we're going to get some shirts that say what? Behave your damn self. Take it away, Joe Hall and the Kane Curtis. Mm -hmm. 